Hello, welcome to Mark's Cookery Show. Today is Boxing Day. We're making the Boxing Day meal. First thing we're going to start off doing is making the apple pie. Just got the apples pressing down here. Just going to add a bit of cinnamon into it. Don't need much cinnamon, just a little bit. That's enough. Touch the lemon. That's the coffee that's still sits right. We're going to quick stir in the just added a bit of sweetener to the apples to make them a bit sweeter. We're going to give it a quick toss in those liquids and just get it all mixed up. And it's smelling really nice up to now. Just let them cook down to be nice and let them cool down and put them into the pie. Okay, that's it for now. Going to get the parsnips ready now and the carrots. Got the carrots here with some sprouts, got the potatoes there, got some onions there, got some herbs there. The apples are just taken off the heat. Let them cool down before they eat the pastry. Let's sort these parsnips out. Tidy up, put these bits in the bin, good parsley. need them look a bit tatty. They can be tucked. Tie the other end. Have them sort of same size. Do all rolls at the same time. If that's a bit tiny, that will burn. Then okay, let's tidy up and do the carrots. I think it's time for a beer. We'll get one in a second. Got one in the fridge. Cold, ready. You can see me pouring it out. Listen to that. Put it into the glass. So it tastes like not too bad for beer. And the coffee in a minute. That past it. Let's do the carrots. Now I'm just cooking the carrots up for roasting. You don't need to be perfect. Just got to watch it. Okay, this is the carrots and the pasta done, and the potatoes are done too in that dish. They're ready to go into the oven soon. Just need a bit of honey on those, a bit of salt and pepper, 
a bit of oil, just to make sure a bit of oil to be ready to cook in the oven. Okay, so that's it. Now the next thing is to make the cake. Okay, so I'm going to carry on. Those are the potatoes. Okay then, now we can start stuffing. Chop up this one again. Half an onion for the stuffing, that'd be enough. Always got to watch your fingers when you're chopping on it like this. Don't need much on again. That'd be enough. Second thing I'm going to do is chop the bacon up and fry it off. Now, I'm going to do the bacon. These spices should be enough. Keep the fat on for the flavouring. Could use any baking, just chop it up just fine. Second thing I need to do is get some pot, get some chestnuts chopped up. First thing we must do is clean this chopping board down. Okay, that's just the chopping board cleaned down. Just waiting for that pan to get hot before I put the butter in and cook this bacon off with, with the onions. Now I'm going to chop some chestnuts up. That, those are the apples that have been cut. These are the chestnuts that I'm using. What chestnuts? Do I have another packet? Just there, ready to go. Oh, you want to see me chopping them up? Okay. Don't know how the camera can see it. Can you hear that pan getting hot? Can you hear it? And quite rough, rough looking. Okay, let's take this out of the way. That, that. Okay, let's go back to the pan. Pan is nice and hot. Chuck that in. Put a bit of oil into it. Sure enough, chuck the onions in, let them sweat down, chuck those in, put the lid back on, we'll come back to it in a second. Okay, now we've got these section down, let's put a bit of salt and pepper in it. Please, they look and look nicely. Get it goes off to eat soon. Put the lid back on and just let it set them down for another two minutes. Okay, now got myself a bowl. These are going in this bowl. Some of these, some of these, some of this uh, mixed stuffing from Sainsbury's. Just open it and chuck it in there. 
that will be the basis of this stuffing. Take the little touch of water. Mix it together. Okay, now I'm going to get the potatoes ready. I've got a bit of dry herbs in with them. Just a few of them up. Three herbs in there. And a bit of honey too in there. We're going to roast in them. Got quite a bit too. It's Christmas. Oil for that. Do some of this. I need a bit of oil for that too. Better season these up. Get the salt and pepper. You must remember to season everything. And the salt. And the pepper. Plenty of these. It is Christmas. Got to give these good stir up. Let's wait for a second. Right, listen. Don't worry, one drops out. Put it back in. Give these a good stir. Up. Got a bit more oil in them. Put a bit of butter in instead. Probably use half this block. There, and that into there. That will melt down if it gets in the oven. Won't be long till we put these in the oven. Can save that rest of that butter for later. Time for a new drink. Getting quite thirsty now. I think it's time for a drink. Got one here. That's how we go. Ready to go, and it's nice and cold. Okay, now it's time to sort the apple pie. I bought puff pastry and normal pastry. Easier just to buy it instead of making it. And those are the apples there. Now I'm going to put the pastry, base of the pastry in there, the base of it. Just a good tip always butter up with tray, and it will, the apple pie will come out dead easy. Okay, that's his apple pie done now. Put that in the fridge for later and just, just in a minute or two, put those in the oven and get the stuffing balls ready to be cooked. Okay, now I've got the table ready. I set a few drinks up, some alcoholic drinks and some non-alcoholic drinks. Got a bit of gin going today and some living gin and it will knock you out really good stuff and a bit of lemonade to mix it with just going to set the table let's see what I've got over here going I've got the lamb steaks ready to be cooked off in a second with the onions I've got to chop up in a second I've got myself a beer I've got the stock going and the stock pan ready for the gravy that pan is getting hot and let's see what I've got in here the potatoes cooking I've got the parsnips and the carrots that sounds like it's getting nice and hot I'm going to put a nice lump of butter in it I do a James Martin it 
In it goes. Look at that. Okay, let's cut up the potatoes. Let's Getting up, let's get this lamb in. So look at all the nice lamb steaks. So seasoning up. First thing that we like to make. And just salt and pepper in here. See that being up now? It's already gone. Just give it a quick clean, get them sealed, and get the juice in there. Okay, nice. Let's have a quick look what's going on. The onions are there cooked and sweated down. Just go and check how the steak's looking. Nicely. Turn it over. Check how these are going. Nicely. Okay. There's a quick shot. Okay, now I'm going to put those onions into that pan. Okay, now I'm going to put these yolks of puddings in, pre bought ones, dead easy, you're not messing around with batter and wasting time when it's drinking time. Okay, the juices in a second are going to go into that stock pan. Look at all them wonderful juices in the bottom of that pan. Now they're going in that oven. Okay, we can go in the oven now about five minutes then to finish off okay they're going in that put that stock into that pan it smells damn good
Got my own fuel needs going, that bit of flavour. That's to finish off. And that looks nice too. So put the lid back on that. Tidy up. Bob's uncle. Now I've just got to set the table. Right then, that is the food been done. Sort the table out, the drinks been served. Gravy's been made. The lamb's there. The stuffing's there. Lots of pudding's there and the mixed roast bread's there. And we've got some drinks ready to be served up. Just clear the kitchen up. Just time to put the apple pie in. Show you where the apple pie is. Just going to get a gin ready. I've got myself a nice glass for the gin. Just drinking this nice living gin. I put this apple pie in. Okay, now the oven's getting up. Uh, that's okay, about 40 minutes to cook. Okay. This is apple pie cooked. Now I'm going to pour myself a nice drink. Got some living gin there. Put plenty in. This is boxing night. Plenty there. And put a bit of tonic water in. That looks nice. Got some lemonade here for Diana. Put it down on our alcoholic gin tonight. Pour that in. Plenty left here. Maybe a touch of this in a, in a make her sleep a bit more. What do you reckon? Cock or two? Why not? It's Christmas. Why not? We'll finish it off. Look at that. Okay. Right, so I caught this rascal. Time to tuck into this apple pie what I made today. I'm going to have some nice cream with it. Creamed in the fridge. So I'll show you what cream we've got. I think this is Bailey's cream. I don't think we're having that one. Where is it? That's the cream there. Let's serve this up. Does it look too bad on Boxing Day night? That's what's left of the apple pie that we'll do for breakfast tomorrow. We'll clean up later. Let's go and enjoy this.